Hi there, this is Bob Strodel, the Executive Director of Christian Camps and Conferencing, and uh, I'm on the stone wall at the front lawn here at Brookwoods and Deer Run. I wanted to give you a brief update on our ministry and tell you about some of the things that have happened and hopefully will happen in the future. First of all, I want to thank you for being a member of the Camp family. We've had a lot of support over the last six months uh, through uh, prayers, uh, through donations, uh, through words of encouragement, through text, through email. It's just meant a lot to us on the staff. Um, it's been a sad time for us because we missed the summer. And I know some of you did too. And I know some of your kids certainly did miss the summer too. We look forward to in the future, 2021, next summer, uh, everyone being back together again, Lord, Lord willing. But this summer in New Hampshire, uh, we ran Winnipesaukee weekends. We had families up here renting the cabins. Um, that was a lot of fun. And in Maine, we did cabin camping where families could come up and rent a cabin and experience the wilds of, uh, of the Maine woods. And uh, we had more people than we thought. It was just really encouraging to us. Uh, we didn't have as many staff, of course, hosting, uh, but it was really encouraging to us to see the people that turned out this year. Uh, we did take a financial hit. Uh, we've lost money because we couldn't run the camp. We've also lost money because we couldn't run the conference ministry here uh, in New Hampshire and, and Maine, too, during these times when churches, because they were not getting together in schools when they were not in session, couldn't come up and enjoy the, the property. Our income was probably down about $2.7 million. Our staff have worked very, very hard uh, to reduce that deficit as much as possible. Clearly, we didn't have some expenses this summer, uh, running summer camps and all the staffing involved with that. Uh, we projected a deficit this year of about a million dollars. Uh, and now I'm just happy to report that uh, through the hard work of a lot of folks and through some donations from some folks, uh, we're looking at just a, a deficit this year of about $700,000. Certainly, uh, continue to pray for camp uh, that we can meet that deficit. Uh, if you're inclined and the Lord has blessed you financially, we'd appreciate some help too in that deficit. And you can contact me or Ann Higgins, our Director of Development. We would certainly appreciate help on that. We'd like to ask for your prayers too. While we are very happy that nobody associated with camp got infected with COVID this summer, our staff were fine and our guests were fine. Uh, we know that a lot of people were hurting. Uh, we know there was some sickness. Uh, we know there's some job loss and certainly major disruption. We just ask you to continue to pray for our country and our world uh, that this will pass by. That next summer we'll be able to minister to the kids like we always have. Uh, we hope everything will be normal back then. We hope we can run full camps in New Hampshire uh, and in Maine. And we're looking forward to the conference groups returning uh, very soon here uh, to New Hampshire and in Maine also that we can minister to the local area churches in New England. Thank you very much for being a member of the camp family. Thank you for your support. Thank you for those who supported us through prayer. Thank you for those who supported us through donations and supported us for sending your kids to camp. Take care.